Hello everybody, my name is Superscroll, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Emerald Nuzlocke Randomizer. Where we last left off, we just got through Petalbar Words, I explained a lot of stuff about about fishing and Pokemon stuff, and got you some items and whatever, and my, my Mantine died, I think it was last episode, yeah it was last episode, I think my Mantine died, that pretty pissed me off pretty pissed me off no i don't think i don't even know oh god so this was the problem with when i record in bulk i don't know what happens last episode completely because i'm thinking of all the episodes that just happened but my man did die so i'm pretty mad about that anyway we made it to rest for city here if you guys come here beside the beside the uh p blah blah piece pokemon center the cutter's house is here you guys go in there if you actually can make it through the door and talk to this dude that determine that, 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 that determine expression that limber way you move okay where are we getting with this and you're well okay, you're talking about Pokemon, right? You're not talking about the way I move, are you? And you're a well-trained Pokemon. You're obviously a skilled trainer. No, wait, don't say a word. I can tell you just by looking at you. I'm sure that you can put this to hidden machine to good use. No need to be modest or shy. Go and take it. You get HMON, which is cut. That's why this guy's called the Cutter's House. Honestly, if you first played this game, it does it does say Cutter's House, but you didn't even know you need to get the HMON cut. HMON cut, so... It, it, it doesn't make it really obvious where you need to go to get the HMO one cut. You just need to explore a little bit. I'm going to right away teach that to Cutter here. And, because that's what he's going to be using it anyway. And I'm going to go here to the Pokemart. And buy some Pokeballs, I guess. How many can I get? I can get 12. I'm going to get 5. And then after that, I'm going to buy some Super Potions. How many can I get? I can get 2. Let's just get that. I know I'm spending all my money, which is really a smart idea. I'm actually gonna sell. Um, it's not a smart idea to do this. I'm gonna sell my X Defend because it's not important. Anyway, if you guys come here, this is the Pokemon Trainer School. Will I teach you anything about Pokemon? And you just bunch of trainers and stuff. I right hear you can read this book. I think is a student notebook. Pokemon not to be caught. You can Pokeballs up to six Pokemon can accompany a trainer. Trainer is someone who can catch Pokemon, raise them in battle. Blah blah blah. Trainer mission to defeat the strong trainers who await. Why is this guy talking so much? Hey, well it's the book that's talking. The dude's in my way. Let me read what's on the board here. Blackboard list status change that may affect Pokemon in battle. Yes. So. Poison here. It will steadily lose HP if it's poison. The effects of poison remain after a battle. A poison Pokemon HP will drop while it is traveling. Heal a poison using an antidote. Which type you want to read? Burn it. Burn it reduces attack power and it steadily reduces the victim's HP. A burn lingers after battle. Cure a burn with using a burn heal. So burn basically cuts your attack stat, stat, attack stat in half if you have that, that uh, infliction. Paralyzed speeds drop. It cuts your speed stat in half if you're paralyzed. And frozen is a Pokemon is frozen becomes completely helpless. It will remain frozen after battle. Then thought thought out using an ice heal. Honestly, also if I keep saying honestly instead of what I want to say as a transition word, um, if you're frozen and the Pokemon attacks you with a fire type move, then you'll be defrosted and falls asleep. It'll be unable to attack. Pokemon will wake it. Blah blah blah. Sleeping, it will stay asleep. Wake it up using an awakening. Nothing. Talk to this dude. He'll be running around like a weirdo. And walk back here. Students who don't study get a little taste of my Quick Claw. Whether or not you're a good student will be evident from the way you use this item. Tank Quick Claw. Basically, if you give this to a slow Pokemon or any Pokemon, you will have a chance of going first. I don't really need that because two of my Pokemon are already fast, so that really doesn't matter. And I'm just gonna before I go to the you saw the gyms right here. I'll just show you what the type of the gym is. You probably know by this point in the game. Roxanne, the rock loving honor student. Yeah, so she's an honor student. She went to the trainer school, which is just south of where I just showed you. Route 115, you can actually get a Pokemon here. But like, there's no grass, and I don't have an old rod yet, so I can't get it yet. And you can get a super potion up here, really useful. I'm first going to actually go down this way, so that I can catch... Um, this is time saving tunnel near nearing completion it, it, it is what it says on the sign but there's also a big x splashed across it in red paint okay so now we're on route 116 we can actually get a new pokemon on this route All right this item right here is a repel so i'm gonna go pick it pick that up quickly maybe battle this trainer here before i get the pokemon that i want or not that i want because actually this area right here is where you can catch a ninkata so if you guys want to get a shedinja and a that's gonna hurt Shedinja or a cut is actually a really powerful move for this point in the game. More powerful than pound. Yeah, so this guy has an Inkata. 
If you want to get a, a Ninjask and, or a, nin, or, and a Shedinja, then you can get a Ninkata and train it up to level 20, which it went, which then it will evolve to a Ninjask. And because it's a ground type and bug type, then grass type moves will be will be um will do normal damage to it because super effective on the ground and not very effective on the. I'm gonna switch. I'm gonna go ahead and switch to my clay phase just for a second, and we're gonna try to run into a Pokemon here. Let's see what we get. We got a Snorlax. Wow. I'm not sure if I'm gonna use that, but I'm definitely gonna poison it because that's the only way I'm gonna whittle it down enough that I can catch it because it's hard to catch. Plus, it's really uh, defensive. uses leftovers. Why does it have leftovers? Come on, don't do that. Why does it special Oh, it's raising. Okay, it's raising its special defense and it uses... Okay. Crap, this could actually kill me in one in another hit. I'm just gonna... Ooh, I used my orange berry. Awesome. Okay, I hope the poison doesn't kill it when I try to catch it, because if it does, I'm gonna be pretty pissed off. As long as it keeps using its leftovers, I don't think poison will kill it. I wish it would go to rest or something. I should have used a great ball just to see if I can catch it. This won't catch it. Use tackle. Please, yeah. Okay, come on, poison don't kill it. I'm gonna use the Great Ball to see if I can kill it before the poison does. Can we catch it before the poison does? Ah, come on! Please don't kill it, poison. It, it'll kill it. It'll kill it. The poison's gonna kill it. Of course, I killed it. Great. Now, another po I shouldn't have poisoned it. That was stupid. I can't catch another Pokemon. But what I can do is uh, battle these trainers up here. You got a match up. That's fine. I'll use a pound on you. Holy crap. Seriously? Come on. Lost another Pokemon. I didn't really care for Grimer, though. But now I only have two Pokemon. I could have had so many more Pokemon. I only have two. That's ridiculous. I was going to go catch another Pokemon, but I'll wait till later. So let's just go heal up. I'm not too sad about those because they weren't good Pokemon. I mean, I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have mind kept my Mantine. But I will get another Water type eventually, hopefully. So I'm going to deposit my Grimer, my Clayface, to death. Yeah, to death. I know, it's pretty sad. I'm gonna give myself... Oh, I do have an or... What, what am I doing? I'm gonna give that to my cutter. And I'm gonna go take on the gym now. Because there's really nothing else to do. And... Yeah. Use a bullet seed to take it down one hit, probably. No two, I guess I'm not high enough level yet. But this, after this, I will be high enough level. Great. Level 14. I just need to be like a level 15. So this is a double battle here if you step here. I really don't want to do this because they do have two Geodudes. And I'm going to send out my my uh, my Ghost Rider, which could possibly die in this battle. So I'm going to use a Bullet Seed. And I'm going to use a Growl. Great. Take that in one shot. And this is another Geodude, so my Growl will go. And hopefully, hopefully if it uses Rock Tomb or something like that, it won't. So I'll use Bullet Seed on this dude, and I'll just Amber on this dude, I guess. It only resists it. It resists it, but it is only defensive and not special defensive. So there's a chance that it'll do a little bit of damage, a decent amount of damage, yeah. I guess it's okay for something that resists it. I'll Bullet Seed you, and I'll Amber you again. I'm actually really hungry right now because I, I I don't like to eat. I'm, like I said in one of the other videos, I'm not really a fan of food. At level 14, that's good for this gym. I don't even think I need to heal up after that. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna not going to. But here's Roxanne, the gym leader. Yeah, I haven't eaten breakfast yet, and I normally don't. But it's like 1:05, and I really do want to go eat because I'm, I'm 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 really hungry. So I'll take that down easy, no problem. Geodude's coming out next. There is a rule that I, w I wanted to play by that basically once you catch your once you catch your first Pokemon that you have to get rid of your I'm gonna go for a cut and see how much that does nothing okay uses a harden that's not okay. that's not bad because grass type moves are special and this does this guy is packing a, a, a citrus berry I think that did a decent amount of damage actually an orange berry okay and she has two potions left to use on this thing so I do want to kill it one more hit please it's gonna use a potion so don't kill me Great. I'm going to use a potion this turn because it's going to use a potion. I actually do use my orange berry. I'm still going to go ahead and use a potion. Because uh, the gym leader, Roxanne, is going to use a potion anyway. And I said potion so many times in that statement. But I'm going to go ahead and use a potion. Because she's going to go ahead and use a potion. And I'm going to go for an absorb, actually. 
I can't escape now because it uses block. Block is basically a mean look wannabe. And she's another potion. Okay, that's fine. As long as I can get enough hits to kill it. She can't use any more potions and she ran out of berries. So this probably will kill it. If not, one more hit will. It isn't too bad if you have a water or a grass type. If you had, if I, if I, if I used Mantine on this, Rock Tomb would have been super effective because I'm a part flying type. So I, it was a good thing that I didn't have it in a way. It would, it would have died here anyway, possibly. So, anyway, you get the Rock Sand badge. <laughs> you get the Rock Sand badge. You get the, the, bad, the, the whatever badge. I, I'm not even caring about this anymore, honestly, which is really not good. You get Rock Tomb here. Uh, and that's that. I'm fast forwarding so much. I don't think I haven't, I haven't, I don't think I haven't stopped fast forwarding for that entire gym. Okay, and you see the Team Aqua grunt dude running away in this dude. Wait, please, don't take my goods. Is it the same dude that got robbed again twice? Or almost got robbed? This dude got really unlucky if he's been robbed so much. Um, yeah, so, we guess we can go up here. Nothing much to do. Actually, if you go down here, actually, no, I think I have enough. Um, I don't even know where I'm going with this. Here. I'm gonna switch. I honestly don't even have Pokemon that are really good right now. So you go out this way. So it, oh, it's you, that fantastic trainer who helped me. So it is the same dude. I have the Impedible Woods. Help me. I, I I was robbed by Team Aqua. I have to get the Devon Goods back. If I don't, I'm gonna be in serious trouble. So I guess we'll go out here and do some. Uh, we can get a Zubat here. Okay, that's interesting. I could have gotten one at least. This is the same route. I'll battle you too. There's some battles you can do here. Not really important yet because I want to get another Pokemon and then come back here later and train. I will definitely, if I catch another Pokemon, I'm not going to train on screen anymore because that's just, it's going to be too boring. Sunflora, eh? Not bad. I don't ever, I've never used Sunflora. As as the rules state, it, it's it, it's trying to get me to use Pokemon that I've never used before. This is a double battle here. I don't really want to fight a double battle. If you want to get out of it, you can either wait till that guy up there turns around. Or just talk to this dude here. This dude is a Geodude. This dude is Geodude. This dude has a Geodude, which isn't good for me. But it's fine, because Ember three times, it should be enough. It was Burn too. And so it, the Burn won't take it out this turn, but Tackle will. That's awesome. So, if I can just sneak past this guy with the him turning. This is another double battle here. Damn it, I got into the double battle. Oh well. I got turned around too fast. Either way, Shroomish and Geodude, I'll be able to take this guy out fast. So Ember on the Shroomish and Bullet Seed on the Geodude. And now that I have the first gym badge, I probably won't be using Cutter. So I do want to get another Pokemon and definitely train it up a high level. Because now Cutter will only be used my, my HM Slave, really. I hope, I hope it can learn Rock Smash. If not, oh well. I'm trying to learn Pursuit. No, I'm not going to learn that. Tackle will take it out for sure. And now I'm just like zooming through this game. Oh, Bullet Seed as well. Tackle, please take it out. Thank you. If you guys didn't know, Lotad is a grass water type, so it does lose a lot of weaknesses, like ice is not... Oh, I'm evolving. Awesome. The first evolution of the game to a Pokemon that I'm not going to be using. So unfortunately, Rapidash is already fully evolved, so you cannot see its evolution. That's my one problem. If I catch evolved Pokemon, you don't get to see it evolved. But I do want to not be able... Because there's a lot of evolved Pokemon that I can get, so... I'm dizzy from talking so much, honestly. After this episode is done, I'm going to go eat. Turn in Fury Cutter. I don't think I'm going to learn that. It's a Bug-type move. And you can actually, now that you have Cut, I can actually go out here and train those people. But I'm going to wait until I get another Pokemon first. So if you guys come up here, this is a X Special. God, I know a lot of the items in this game. I don't know why. It's random knowledge. Uh, in this folder here, there's no item there. This dude here is just standing out here weirdly, so let's talk to him. Oh, what am I to do? We were we were on our walk, Pico and I, when we jumped by an author. The scoundrel made off with my darling Pico. Roar, Pico! I'm guessing Pico is a Pokemon. So we're now in Rust Eternal. We can actually... Rust Eternal, yeah, I said that. This up here is a Pokeball. I can actually hit a Pokemon now. Hopefully it's something good. A Nidoran. Seriously, I don't really want to use Nidoran because... Well, I used one already, and I got poison for poison point. I, I used one already. I'm catching Pokemon that I already used in my first Let's Play, which isn't great. I don't want to use Nidoran again. Please catch. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to use a Nidoran, actually, even though I have to use a Pokemon I've gotten. I'm going to name it. Mm, what should I name it? It's like a poison Pokemon with a horn. What should I name it? I don't even know. 
I'm gonna actually just name it the same thing I named it in my first one, which is really boring, really. But I caught two Pokemon. I have two Pokemon now in my in my in, in my team that I've already used to catch. Mm, do I have a Petra Berry? I do, or Peach Berry, whatever you want to pronounce it. I already have two Pokemon now that I've already used in my first Let's Play, which is actually not great. I wanted to. Oh, Helmdar! Why didn't I get that? That's much better. Anyway, I'm gonna talk to this dude. I'm the first chance I get. I'm gonna catch another. Um, like, I'm definitely gonna get another. I don't really care for Poison type right now, Pokemon, because they're not gonna be helpful at all. So we just Ember that, level up. Awesome. Team Aqua got defeated. The same dude through battle. And Pico, I guess, is that Wingle right there beside him. I want it back. If you want it back, that badly take it. Devon Goods. So we get the Devon Bugs back. Devon Bugs. Yeah, I said Devon Bugs. I'm just recording so much, talking so fast, and I guess it's the fact that I'm dizzy and haven't eaten that I'm talking prob uh, not not probably. My tea here has actually gotten really cold, so it's kind of disgusting. And Pico owes you her life. Thank you. Call me. Call me. Oh, this is Mr. Briny here. I think I'm gonna go back and make a different cup of of tea because uh, Pico is that what Pico said? Anyway, so we made it through here. We just did a bunch of stuff. Oh, cool. Krana, why didn't I get that? Jesus, I was missing out on the good Pokemon. So, um, I won't be training off screen for any, for any reason. We did get our good Devon Goods back, and by the way, if we make it back to Rust, we have to make it back to Rustboro Town and give our goods back to Thing, to that, that Devon, that, that, that Devon worker or whatever. But we did enough in this episode, we, like, battled the gym leader and stuff. So, I'll see you guys next time after I've eaten my breakfast, even though it's, like, one, probably my lunch now. Um, I'm gonna see you guys next time for Let's Play. Pokemon Emerald Nuzlocke Randomizer. Say that five times fast. It is a mouthful to say. So you guys, I can, I'm actually surprised I haven't messed that up yet. Well, I have once, I think, but that doesn't matter. See you guys next time.